fly. We got a new Morpheus. Oh. What? A young fuckable Morpheus. Hey, hey, what's up, everybody? It is me. Sean Tanktop. I'm over here constantly Tank Tanktop. I'm hanging out with my very good friends, Dustin and Morgan Drace over there at the Dojo Drace. How are you doing over there, Draces? What's up? I'm doing great. Excellent. Excellent. Well, I mean, <laughs> what if, what if I, what if, what if I told you Ugh. that there was a Matrix? What if I told you that there were some movies around it that, that were about the Matrix? They were pretty popular back when we was kids, and they got this here new one called The Matrix Resurrections. That just came out and they just dropped a trailer. What if I told? What if I told you that? Hmm. I'd believe you. I... I'm, yeah, we're we're, uh, we're over here. We're gonna check out the Matrix Resurrections. It's the new trailer. We haven't had a Matrix movie since like 2003, I think, or something like that. And Shit. it's sure. been a hot minute. And you know. WB wants to shore up a bunch of their IPs and they want to fucking, you know, they want to maybe kickstart like some new stuff with this. Um, do you guys have any expectations whatsoever? I was not expecting or necessarily even wanted nope. a Matrix sequel. I didn't know they were doing this, so I'm totally, totally blind. I have no idea what's the what's the story, what's the whole, what's the tea, what's the thing. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't really either. I think it was also because, like, I... Because I was so into it when I was a kid. And then, yeah. like, you know, the sequels were kind of, like, whatever. I mean, I think that they were maybe a little bit better than people give them credit for, but also they had some problems and shit. And so, like, I kind of sort of just left it and stuff. So it'll be interesting to see what ideas they have in picking this back up and who's going to be back, who's not, how it's going to do. I don't know. Do you guys want to check it out? Let's yes. do it. Oh, look, we got a Sanctum Santorum. It's Tom. It's, oh, a cat. You'll be triggered right now. Can you tell me what happened? I had dreams that weren't just dreams. Whoa. And you're Patrick Harris? Yes. Nice. Why is he Thomas? They didn't use what word? Crazy. Okay. What? Crazy. Ooh. He's at a therapist. <laughs> That's cute. Did he go back into the Matrix? What? what are they doing? Why are they in the Matrix again? How'd you end up there? Who the hell? Maybe he got sick of Zion. Well, he got assimilated back into the Matrix, so maybe this is just another version of Oh, he did. I'm yeah. totally lost. <laughs> okay, that makes sense then. <laughs> hmm. A little heavy-handed, but okay. Yeah, right? Time to fly. We got a new Morpheus. Oh. What? We got a, a, new can young, a new Candyman Morpheus. A young fuckable Morpheus. Yeah. It's like a young Dumbledore over here. The only thing that matters to you is still here. I know it's why you're still fighting and why you will never give up. You don't know me. No? Ooh, we got a little <laughs> ancient one action. Wow. Oh, got some agents. Ooh. So she went back in. She was fucking dead at the end of the last yeah. one. Wait, she so... was dead? I totally do not remember a fucking thing from that third one. We're gonna have to watch it again. <laughs> she was dead. Did she get cloned? Did she get matrixed? I'm confused. Going back to where oh. started. Who's this? Back to the matrix. Interesting. Okay, he said it. He said the thing. Whoa, he said the thing. Hmm. So wait. <laughs> the lady was dead. He was yeah, sucked back in the she, Matrix. She definitely yeah. died. He got assimilated back into the system, and that's how Who they were Who was in Zion? To... 
Zion was saved. Zion was. Yeah. Well, who was there? Who all was there? Morpheus all or the, yeah, Morpheus too? Yeah, and, and Morpheus and Jada Pink and Smith and a bunch of the rest of them and stuff. Well, you said that he got smushed back into the Matrix in the last one, so that's he why did. he's in it. Well, that's why he's in it. Well, it, he he technically kind of like we don't. We, the thing is, we it was it, we don't really know exactly what it was that happened. Like he could have died. He assimilates his code back into the Matrix and it kind of resets. And the whole thing at the end of the third movie was basically, it was essentially where the, it, it was basically like where the machine said, okay, we're going to call a truce and what people will get is a choice to either stay in it or be a part of the real world. Okay. And, and so that was, and so it, he was like, it was, it was not very clear that he died, but it was like, it was a very... Joseph Campbell, I'm assimilated, I've sacrificed myself, very kind of, you know, computer Jesus type of shit. So we don't know exactly why it is that he's back within this whole thing. You know I do I mean? like the Matrix got smart where they're like, maybe if we give him therapy, yeah. he won't flip out this time <laughs> yeah. and cause and a ruckus. Right, right, and he won't do it. I think I think it'll just Give him a therapist be... and let's give that therapist a cat. Morgan... I, I literally like just put on while I was while I was biking this morning. I put on yeah. the second movie, so I've kind of started to kind of get back into it. It kind of rejogged all those juices. There's a lot of people out here that haven't really been fucking thinking about this shit at all, and haven't really been considering it all. It's just like you know, Keanu's like very hot coming off of John Wick, and we had a Ke we had a big hot Keanu summer, and they're like. I don't know. Let's see if we can get another one of these going. It's a big property. Yeah. It was one of here the, he it was, is. It was a fucking enormous hit. Back in the day, um, I like the whole idea of, yeah, I mean, like, of, of like, why is Trinity back? How is Trinity back? I mean, like, it's you know, it's computer programmed, so it seems like you could. She's a bad guy. You could explode. That would be interesting. That would be interesting cool. if she was like a point for them to lure him out. Like, what if, like, that was like, what if, like, it was instead of Morpheus. You know, because Morpheus was like, I need to lure you out. You're the one, you know, like, what if, like, what if it was a program that was designed to lure him out, but he would be helping the machines? Yeah. You know what I mean? Like a weird double Like a Manchurian that... candidate type deal? <laughs> <laughs> right. Absolutely. I mean, this is something that you had mentioned when we talked about this a couple of days ago, where you're just interested in, like, you know, like, the iconography of this story has kind of been hijacked by a bunch of fucking losers and like you wonder if they're going to like if that's going to be like kind of weirdly addressed in any way or if that's going to be a part of it because it's like we have you know like a 150 million dollar tentpole you know movie being directed by a trans yeah. woman like i mean like that's they that's show fucking... neo like voting like no i am pro pro choice <laughs> <laughs> it's possible you know what i they mean they just like, show neo being nice to women oh yeah <laughs> like 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 he has a uh he has a lady co-worker that he's just kind of he was pretty you yeah. know he was pretty i mean he, i think he was pretty nice to just he seemed all the like a total, that, yeah he seemed like a chill dude in the front yeah. in the movie so yeah, i think he was okay i think he was all right you know what i mean like i i we like see him getting that, vaccinated at the doctor's office <laughs> Getting his flu shot. That would be amazing. <laughs> no, I do kind of like that he definitely was like, he was like, he's like, okay, I'll do your movie. I just get to keep my hair and my beard, which is what they should have done with Bill and sure. Ted. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? I think it's yeah. just it's just the Keanu look now. And I think that, yep. and I like the fact that they kind of updated it and they got this new thing going on. Um, yeah. Yeah, I mean, and, and I'm excited to see Yaya again. I mean, that guy, like, uh, you know, hopefully I'm saying his name right. Uh, yeah, I mean, I like that so. dude is, like, I'm glad that he got to be a leading man in Candyman because he was so amazing as as Doctor Manhattan. Yeah. You know, even though mm -hmm. he was like a secret lead that wasn't the lead. In yeah, that, right. You know, right. but mm -hmm. uh, he was so good in that. He's just been. He was amazing he was, as Manta in Aquaman. I thought yeah, he was great. I, I thought he was. I thought he was great in that. So I, yeah. yeah, they're going. I mean, WB's going yah yah crazy over there, man. They're going. Yeah, they're man. going gaga for yah yah over there. You I know mean, what I mean, as, like, as they fucking should. Yeah, as like he's on fire. He were having a hot yah yah summer. Yeah, like who is like is that? I mean, and this is gonna. Be, this would be very rote, and I don't think it'd be a good idea if they did it. If they necessarily did it this way, but you know, is that Morpheus's son? Did Morpheus have a son? He never talked about having a son. You know mm. what I mean? Like, I think it maybe. Possibly Are you could... saying Morpheus is a possibility in a universe where Morpheus wasn't fucking? 
Yeah, right? Because I, yeah, I don't he, see that. He, he, With a duster I, like I, that, that guy fucks. That yeah, guy he fucks for sure. Fucked. Yeah, like that he, guy well, remember, fucked. remember he was the one he gave that big speech in the in the in the reloaded one. And then, like, he just said, and now we're going to dance and we're going to shake these walls. And they had, like, that big cave techno fuckathon or whatever it was that was in there, um, which, like, went on for a couple more, a couple more minutes more than it should have. Uh, but, like, um, I mean, I, I think that there's some things that, I, as far as I understand, he is not, Lawrence Fishburne was not asked to be back. Correct. That's weird. Well, yeah. Yeah, they, I, I mean, I think didn't that, fit I think him into the story. Was, yeah. I think that he was. But they a have little, a Morpheus. I, well, well, I, I think, don't know. I, we don't know if that's Morpheus. I mean, we don't you know. know if that's Morpheus or what the what what the mechanic of it is. You know, to get him in there. I mean, like I know that him and him and you know Keanu are probably still pretty pretty close because he's been. They've instituted him into the John Wick movies. Yep. Now, yeah, yeah. So they're yeah. like, so they're clearly still okay with one another, and it was always fun to see them come together, you know, and just and and just they're like, oh, yeah. it's Morpheus and Neo, you know, it's this is kind of fun. Yeah. But like the, I mean, obviously, to hear Lawrence Fishburne, the Great Orator, one of the one of the greats to come and hello, Neo, like whatever, what the right? guy told you, they're like it would it yeah. would be great, but get a cowboy Carl in there. Get a cowboy Carl in there, absolutely. Like, I mean, I, I think that, I, but I do think that, you know, I do think that some things need to change that can't just kind of be, remember this stuff? Remember the thing that you thought I was I really know, cool? but you like, know? So Neo like, and Morpheus, I feel like, are kind of... Oh, we're getting, Coley, tri I mean, Trinity I mean, is kind of, yeah, you got, you got the core. Yeah, 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 it's Trinity, Morpheus, and Neo are like... That's the, that's the, the dudes. That's the, yeah, that's the, the that's the, that's the squad, and so and and clearly it looks like we have a Morpheus esque figure. Clearly, I mean he's got the he's got mm -hmm. the sunglasses and shit. So I don't know. It'll be this was a long trailer too. It was like almost three minutes long. It had a lot yeah. of stuff in it. Yeah, it and looked cool. It looked it looked good. It looked really yeah, nice. It, yeah, it looked really. Yeah. It looked way better than I expected, honestly. Yeah, I mean, like, and that was and I that was always something that the Wachowski said. That I remember them being good in it to the degree that they would lean really hard on some, like, you know, a lot of, you know, computer generated effects. And especially mm -hmm. at the time that was a big gamble. And some of that stuff looks, still looks pretty damn good. And some of it doesn't, yeah. but I do think that they've made enough movies that they kind of understand like where and when to punch that ticket and stuff. And just, I don't know, just like they, you know, and that's the other thing, like they've had kind of like, you know, some 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 projects that just haven't really quite taken off, I'm sure, in the same way. Obviously, yeah. in the same way that The Matrix have but yeah. has. But I think that them jumping back in the sandbox, taking this new thing, kind of starting back from square one and having Neo, having him be, you know, like having to get reawakened again is interesting. And you know what I mean? And I think that, you yeah. know, I, I, I think it looks... I know that I'll be watching it in December. We got yeah. December's going to be... We're going to have Spider-Man... A lot Multiverse of shit to movie, watch. And we're going to have this one. So, yeah, we got yeah. a bunch of... As long as Warner Brothers doesn't pull a ready Neo one, oh, you know, God. and, like, do a bunch, like, too Vomit. many fucking nods. No. Yeah, I think, I, I, you know, and can't I... Can't with I would, that shit anymore. I would hope, yeah, it, I would hope that they would at least just be like, listen, we can, you know, I mean, because there was that whole concept of... You know, because there were several ones. I think there was like six or seven ones mm -hmm. up until we saw like Neo's story or whatever. And then they would restart the, the Matrix again. And mm -hmm. so that's kind of what I think that this is, or at least this is like the next generation of the Matrix. And so yeah. I think that... Will there or won't there be a spoon? Ooh, do you think, think we're well, gonna like, see a spoon? Do, no, no, it's gonna be this. It's gonna be the spork. They're gonna go to a Wendy's and they're gonna get a spork, and they're gonna have like a really cool, fun bendy. <laughs> what uh, you have to realize is that there is no spork. The, yeah. <laughs> it's one of those things that I just haven't considered for so long that I'm kind of like, oh yeah, I'll totally go again for this one other thing. You know what I mean? Like it, it doesn't sure. feel like it's been trotted out too much and stuff like that. You know, so I'm down to check it out for sure. Uh, yeah, we've watched like 14 Fast and the Furious movies. I, like, why absolutely. not another Matrix? Let's have another Matrix. And only the fourth one in, like, 20 fucking years. So, like, yeah, for sure. Like, I appreciate you guys hanging out there so much over here. Um, thanks a lot for watching. We're definitely going to figure out a way to cover this when it comes out in December. I believe it's coming out in December. And, Christmas, um, so, I mean, yeah. you know, it seems like it'll be a lot of fun to dive back into this world. So we look forward to kind of going through that with all of y'all. If you want to get some really cool exclusive content, including a bunch of podcasts and a bunch of other stuff, you can hit this up over on our Patreon. The link is down, down in the description, and it's in the top pinned comment. We appreciate y'all hanging out with us very much, and we will see y'all later.